As Darren said, when you walk in the door from a hard day at work, the last thing you want to look at is another desk. Do you know what I mean? It's, yeah. it's one of those, those yeah. jarring messages. Yep. You walk through the door and you're like, right, OK. Yeah. So let's pay some bills. Just because Darren thinks when he walks through the door, well, is he buying our apartment? No. Somebody else is. So, you know, when he's... Says when you walk through the door and you don't, you know, after a hard day's work, you don't want to see a study, that's fine. Walk straight past it up to our bar. You don't even have to stop by our study. It's just like, I just, yeah, I don't know, just stupid. And unfortunately, your eye is also drawn to how badly finished the paintwork yes, is up there too. You hit the nail on the head. I, and I'm, I'm bugged by how dirty this place is. I, it bugs me. Mm. I mean, yeah, it's a job site. Yes, it's chaos outside. I get it. I get it. I get it all. But mm. that being dressed like that and not white first, it makes me sad for them. It makes me nervous for them. I, I have all the compassion in the world. I get it. It's a big thing to do this amount of space in that amount of time with that amount of money. I get it. But it's still not good enough. Yeah. Shona also wondered what the point of the low-level shelf was. It's a case of, like, why? She found it random and suggests you remove it. I don't get yeah. what that's for no. other than to, like, polish your shoes or something. I, I don't know. I don't get that. So they weren't that happy with your study. But things did improve as they looked over your dining room. OK, let's, let's start with yeah. some good. Uh, that table is amazing. Table is divine. Yeah, it's beautiful. I love the timber. Stunning, divine and beautiful for how they described your dining table. It's a compliment. Yeah. But they suggested that with a table this grand, then your light feature should match its grandeur. I have nothing against those light fittings. I think they're lovely, but I just think it feels miserly. Mm. It just feels really tiny. Chad also suggested finding some chairs that actually fit under the table. You know that one? I love the table, but you've got to be that really would annoy careful. Me. Yeah, you've got to pick the chairs that go yeah. with the table. Moving into your living room, the judges liked the lamp, the couch and chair. But unfortunately, they didn't feel that collectively it all came together as well as it should have. They've gone to the effort of putting in a fireplace. Mm. But mm. it's just not grand. It's not the, the central point of a room. The central point of the room is the TV. And you know what? That frustrates me like no end. OK, and we, we all work on TV. Yeah. We all love TV. But, but there are ways to do TVs exactly. that don't stare at you. I had this conversation with them during the week in the competition. Mm. They had the Australian made competition and they, they had a TV that wasn't Australian made and made it their focus. Fine, go against everything I say, but we're all feeling the same. In a word, it lacked a bit of soul. The judge is saying that. I don't think that's a good call to say that to, to say that to anyone. There's no soul there, there's no spirit there. It's just, to me, items that have been put there to fill a space. If, if they want to comment stuff like that, they can say, you know, it feels cold, that's fine. You know, and not don't... soul, because soul. we've put our lives on hold and we're giving this 100%. The blind over the window is an odd choice. It, it feels like it's a projection screen that's coming down from the roof and it's very unattractive. You know, there is a window there, other apartments can see in. So if somebody wants some privacy, they're able to put down a blind. Um, if they don't like it, they can roll it back up. And I suppose they're thinking, well, this is grey, it's moody. It's like what they were trying to create in their master bedroom. It's all about creating that mood. It's got no mood at all. In Neil's words, it doesn't feel like it's the living room of a luxury apartment. No, it doesn't. That's basically what it boils yeah. down to for me. I mean, to be very honest with you, I feel like I'm standing in the display apartment of any development anywhere in Australia. Bingo. The judges really want you to think about your balancing of hard and soft surfaces. Because at the moment, your room feels clinical and uninviting. I don't want to sit on that couch. I don't want to sit on that chair. There is nothing in this room that is making me actually want to stay here. The judges hope you can still see this as constructive criticism. There's a difference between judging and just being rude. And they're just being rude. And they're just being rude.
Oh boy. Okay. Shake it off. Yeah, shake That's it off. Is. Shake that off. I don't know. They're very hard to impress. 